Don't worry about the next. It's your boy Chris with the next. And real quick, or even short, quick, or whatever. I just want to talk about the whole um, Black China's mother, uh, Tony, um, Tokyo, whatever her name is, Tokyo Tony, or as my girl Lovely T likes to call her, Teriyaki Tina. Yes, shout out to Lovely T. Um, first of all, this woman, I do feel like she embarrassing as hell. She's the poster child of ghetto ratchetness mothers. First of all, now you're trying to tell your baby, you talk about Black China a mistake. That's your statutory rape, baby. Well, you ratchet as hell. You, you, we already know you probably busted all open for that older man. Because we know we know a lot of younger girls who like older men. And since she was on tape talking about she got to suck a lot of dicks to get China where she was at. You know, she had to... Uh, this has been all type of whores, whoredom, you know. In Black China, I think she don't want to be seen with her mother. Her mother is embarrassing as hell. You know, on live talking about she's going to wash her coochie and sell the a rag for $500. You know, then she twerking on camera you know, and thongs is twerking, you know. She don't look bad for her age, but with age comes wisdom. You should left all that wretchedness behind in your teenage or era or your twenties. She's still trying to act like she's young as hell, like Kanika Jenkins' mother. But there's all types of wretchedness. There's all types of um. Now you feel like this girl owes you something. You know, stop having kids just to um stay on the county. Stop or stop having kids just to use them. Black China don't owe you shit. She got kids and stuff to take care of herself. Should she throw you a bone? Yes. I'm tired of parents using the child uh, as a pawn to get what they want and then talk about, well, I wiped your ass when you was little. You know, I fed you. That was stuff that you were supposed to be doing. If you feel like you wasn't supposed to be doing it, then don't have kids. Give them up for adoption. Why do you feel like you need to blame everything on somebody? Why do you feel the need to use people? Why do you feel you need, you know, you brought this child into this world? You know, this kid did not ask to be here. You know, I'm tired of these parents, especially ghetto ass parents, doing stuff like that. You know, I wouldn't have nothing to do with her either. Now she's talking about she's from the Illuminati. That's why she don't want to give her nothing. She don't want to do nothing. Black China actually did help her, and she quit her job just to try to live off her child. Black China did help you. She did give you a car. She did, you know, try to set you up in the right direction. Now you just want to lay on your ass and not do nothing? I don't blame him. Just like Mariah Carey's um, brother and sister, trying to use her for her money. She put Alice through rehab and all that. And she told Alice and that if you were getting back on that stuff, then I ain't doing nothing for you. You know, why the, why the fuck do you feel like this girl owe you something, you know? Like I said, like with Mariah's um, brother and sister, they just trying to use her for her money. You know, nobody owe you nothing. Nobody has to take care of you. You are a grown adult. Yes, people will help you out. But if they get in the feeling that you just um, trying to live off their fame and fortune, not do nothing, you know, pop off with their money, then that's something different. And they have every right to shut you down, you know, because getting in this industry, whether it's entertainment, you know, music, radio, even YouTube, whatever it is, it's hard. It ain't easy as people think it is. So, so for someone to get success, you know, that is a work of art. That is a work. That is a blessing. That is, you know, you have to put in the work. Everything just can't come easy. Like, you know, people want to post ass pics and all of that. that that's, um, that's a fast burn. So, so for somebody like a Mariah to put in a lot of work or a black China to a certain extent, you know, at the end of the day, no one owes you shit just because you are family. But sometimes family be the ones that take you down faster than any of these strangers. Sometimes these strangers be more, you know, sound than your, than your family or your so-called friends or whatever. Anyway, that's just my take. Any comments, questions, concerns? Leave them in the comment section below. Till then, this has been your boy, Chris with the next. Peace.